You know, we got a beautiful Saturday morning. Um, I'm used to pulling into a parking lot that is just absolutely full of motorcycles and going, Cindy, what in the world's going on here? Um, there's no motorcycles, and <laughs> I really want to ask, Cindy, what the hell did you get me into? Well, there is one motorcycle. I saw one. Oh, but yes, you? this is the Eagles Riders Trick or Trunk, and there are lots of kids out here getting lots of candy. <laughs> is it Trick or Trunk, or is it Trunk and Treat? Oh, it's Trunk and Treat. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay, folks, buckle up. That's the way this one's going to roll, all right? So, uh, hey, want to give a big shout-out to Crambos. No, he doesn't paint cars or work on cars, but by golly, he does great work with the motorcycles. So if you're looking for paint, if you're looking for mechanical work, or if you're looking for accessories, Crambo's out in Greencastle, they will take care of you. And like they say, they get you noticed. Cindy, let's find out. I know the, the, the Eagle Riders are putting this whole thing on, and it's going to be a great thing for the kids. So let's go play around with them. Can you say play around with the kids? No, I don't you can't. Know. That does no. not sound right. But let's go and let's just go have some fun. Let's go. Still Horse is brought to you by Leidendorf Law with over 60 years experience in motorcycle and automotive injury cases. The shit just got real. <laughs> Have you noticed everybody has gone away from the candy? <laughs> wow, everybody went that, that, that was wild. I've never seen a Halloween trick or treat, everybody having fun, to just stop when somebody pulls in. You brought this place to an absolute crawl and a silence. You could hear a pin drop when you came in. Is that normal for you? I gotta ask, is this your last Halloween? That's what I was afraid of. All right, well, thank you for not stabbing me. Anyways. Penny what? what? Pennywise. Pennywise? That is a great costume. I absolutely love it. So is she one of your favorites? So what do you think about all these uh, trunk or treat things going on out here today? Crazy. Crazy? Do you like all the costumes? So is there one that scares you out here? The Pennywise over there. <laughs> All right, will they finally get over by the Grim Reaper? She is trying to keep an eye on that fella right there. <laughs> I don't know. She's a cheese. Look at that. <laughs> Holding on to Mama for dear life up top, boy. That little one. Holy cow. She was hanging on with both hands. Okay, so you guys are the Adams family, right? Yes. yes, we are. You are. So is this your first time being out here? Second. Second? Yeah. It's a pretty cool setup they'd have, don't isn't it? <laughs> yes, absolutely. Yeah. So is is this just your favorite, the Adams family? I love Wednesday. Um, it was her idea. <laughs> oh really? Yeah. She picked the theme. You picked the theme for this? Yes. I love your outfit. Thank you. <laughs> so so why is this your favorite? Um I I don't know. <laughs> you don't know. <laughs> just the creepy other. Have you yeah, just uh, you've other. always liked the Adams family? Yeah. 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 Well, you look just like her, so Thank you're you. so cute. <laughs> well, you guys you. have a great setup here, too. Thank you. I bet the kids love coming over here to get the candy, right? Oh, we're yes. giving out handfuls, yes. Yeah. <laughs> um, that is a lot of candy. Oh, it was up, up here. Was it really? Yes. Yeah. We, we wanted to make sure everyone got their fair share. <gasps> you guys are awesome. Hey, man, Leidendorf Law, personal injury lawyer. I tell you, Leidendorf Law has been a part of this show, a major part of this show, for 20 years. Thank you so much, Leidendorf Law, for what you've done for Steel Horse Thunder and all the riders. Are you having fun out here today? <laughs> Did you always dress like this, or is this just for today? Always. I'm telling you, the whole quietness, it's a fantastic quality when you grow up, okay? <laughs> all right, it was great talking to you. Have fun. All right, man, are you allowed to talk, or are you one of those quiet ones? That's kind of what I thought. You know, you kind of scare me a little bit. <laughs> yeah. All right. What happened to this little fella? Yeah. Didn't pan out so well for you, did it? I can take a hint. I'm out of here. See ya.
All right. I'm told I have to come talk to you. I don't know that I want to or not. What's up, buddy? Um, there's happy clowns, and then there's not so happy clowns. I don't think you're a happy one. Mm. But. <laughs> Do you make people smile with that? Is that right? You get El Cabong and they smile? All right. Just keep smiling. So uh, I, I heard some, some young children over here screaming and crying. Did you have something to do with that? Uh, maybe a little bit, so I left the area. Is that what it was? All right. So it is, you, you, you are kind enough to know that when the kids are petrified of you, you just walk away and let them, let them exactly. move on to something happy? Okay. It's pretty cool. You, do you come out here all the time? Uh, yeah. I'm here quite often. For the trunk and treat? For everyday activities. For everything. All right, so you're pretty active with the Eagles then. I am the vice president of the Airy. Well, you better be active with them then. Yes, and I'm, <laughs> I'm road captain for the Eagle Riders. Gotcha. All right, so you're very busy with them. Very this, busy. Well, dude, what you guys are doing out here is fantastic, man. This is great. There is a ton of people out here, and the way you've set this up here in Plainfield, it is, it's is—it's just amazing. Have you ever seen anything like this before with all this free candy? Um, no. No? Either have I. <laughs> is, who's this? Is this your puppy? That's Lincoln. That's Lincoln. She's afraid of this thing. Yeah. We're trying to take a picture. Oh, you guys got to get pictures. Are you going to you gonna get a picture with that big tall thing? Uh -huh. Yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> so what's your favorite part out here? Is it dressing up or is it getting all the candy? Getting all the candy. Yeah? Do any of these people scare you out here? Yes, the two guys. The two guys? Yeah. Hey, the clown. Hey, the the clown. What's going on over there? Oh, you don't the like clown. the clown? No. <laughs> Hey, that clown scared me. I had to talk to him, and I was a little scared myself, so I understand. All right. Hey, big shout-out to Crambo's out in Greencastle. Man, if you're looking for paint work, mechanical work, or accessories, they have everything you need out in Greencastle. It's Crambo's. You know what they say. They'll get you noticed. Okay, first thing i got to ask you, you're wearing Colts gear. Trick or treat this year? <laughs> Trick. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we got that completely out of now, so... So, so what brought you out here to do the trunk or treat? Out here every year. Is that right? Yep. Been now, doing it since they started. Okay. Yep. Now, are you guys part of the Eagles or yep. anything? Yep. We're members. Yep. Okay. How cool is this, man? This is this I is big. It. it was a lot more people here than I expected. Yep. I, I really wasn't expecting all and this. Everybody gets into it. Yeah. Yes. Well, we and try that's, at least. Oh, so you didn't come straight from? I thought maybe you worked third shift and came no. straight from work. No. no. <laughs> <laughs> that's cool. Yep. So, so what about you? You enjoy handing stuff out to the kids? Yep. Yeah. Now, how old are you? I'm 13. Okay. All right. So now at 13, can do you still get to go out on, and, and trick or treat and stuff? Yeah, I just like to hand out sometimes. Yeah. Well, it's no kind of age limit. Well, that's no. I still, <laughs> I still, dude. I'm 61 years old, and I still dress up every year and go out. It's just now I get to carry a beer with me when I do it. That's the only difference. <laughs> that's the only thing that changes. There you go. No, this is this is super fun. You guys, you guys got it all decked out right here, man. This is this is really cool. It's fun. It's yeah. fun, especially if you don't live in a neighborhood that can do stuff like this. This makes it even fun for you. Exactly, because that's how we are. We don't have kids that come to our our house, so this this is super cool. So, man, I'm glad you guys are here, man. Have fun. You too. Thank you. All right, buddy. Are you having fun out here? Yes. Okay. What's your favorite part about coming out here? Is it the candy? Or do you like dressing up? What is your favorite thing about coming out here for this? Dressing up. Is that more fun than the candy? I like the candy. Yeah, yeah, Can yeah, yeah. Because I got a whole bag full yesterday. And now you got that too? I got like three now. Man, your dentist is going to love you. How? Because. <laughs> All right, so who gave you the best candy out here? Everybody. They all give good candy? All right. All right, well, next year I'm planning on dressing up so I can get candy. And uh, I'm going to see if everybody gives me good candy, too. You go have fun, all right? I will. All right. So you're the Grinch, and it's Halloween trick-or-treating time. Are you out here to try to take everybody else's candy? Yes. <laughs> Is that what it's all about? Yes. <laughs> and to give it to our daughter. 
Oh, okay, so you're going to get the candy and give it to the daughter. All right. Well, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. It's, it's pretty nice out here, too, man. It's all, You almost got too warm of a costume for today. Yes, I do. <laughs> Have you ever been to anything like this? Yes. Where? I went to Main Street, Plainfield, the candy crawl. Gotcha. So you did the candy crawl in Plainfield. Now you're out here doing this. You guys are scoring the mother load, aren't you? Yes, we are. <laughs> yep. <laughs> All right. Well, you guys have fun. So we're out here at the trunk or treat, and I love you guys' costumes. <laughs> Did you make them? No, no. we didn't buy We bought them. <laughs> but they're so cool. I love the butterfly. It's just so flowy. Yeah. Are you guys having a good time? Oh, we're having a great time. Yeah. yeah. Do you come out here every year? Or we do. Yeah. It's so much fun. You like it, don't you? Um, excuse me, I thought you bring kids out to the trick or trunk or trunk or treat. I did. <laughs> I did. I brought my kid. So, so does he go around and get candy? No, I have to give him treats myself. That way they don't have chicken in them. Well, you know, you could start it. You could start a new um, thing where you could have people do it for dogs, and they would have treat treats for the dogs when they I go didn't out. Think about that. It's actually a pretty good idea. It is. <laughs> have fun. This is. This is a golden doodle. He's about two and a half years old. His name is Finn. He is a beautiful dog. Thank you. I appreciate that. <laughs> Thanks for being out here today. Absolutely. Yay! I just have to ask you, are you a busy bee? I am a busy bee. <laughs> are you just a worker bee? Well, I'm both, actually. Yeah. I, I'm, right now, I'm a worker, but a lot of times, I'm a busy <laughs> Well, you guys are having fun. You look so cute. Oh, thank you so much. And we are. we having a blast. So do you come out here and do this every year? Yes. Yes. I do everything at the Eagles. So, so you're a part of the Eagles? Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Big part. <laughs> oh, very good. Well, thank you so much. I'll let you go because I know you're busy. All right. Thank you. All right, Brian. Here we are. Got the trunk or treat going on here at the Eagles Riders in Plainfield. Uh, this is pretty cool, man. How long have you guys been doing this? This has been happening since COVID in 2020 when they told us we couldn't have it inside. Normally we had a haunted house inside, everything in the building, so we came outside. Very successful, so we just wanted to keep repeating it. Uh, you know, that was a time when everybody needed some place to go and get out of the house. Oh, most definitely. Now, do you guys always have sunny and 70 degree weather when you do this? No, not generally. <laughs> <laughs> this is a perfect day. And this is not only the Eagle Rider, but this is the area auxiliary, all the members together throwing this. Okay. So it's just not an Eagle Rider project. It's, it's all of our it's, membership it's all together. The Eagles. Okay. Uh, all the Eagles here in Plainville putting this together. Yes. Wow. No, that's super cool, man. And there's so many people here and everybody is decked out. I mean, oh, yeah. this is super cool. Oh, yeah. I really, uh, really, the people are all getting into it. Uh, uh, as you can see, we got the Grim Reaper here. We've got the uh, Crazy Clown. Uh, you know, everybody's dressed up and, and, and just really getting into the whole theme of it. Yeah, I think it's fantastic. And, and I think I kind of like this. I, now, I know when you guys were doing a haunted house and everything else, I mean, that's all cool, too. Don't right. get me wrong. Do, oh, yeah. Now, do you still do any of that at all, no, or is it strictly out here? Strictly out here, outside, because it's just, it just seems like it's more receptive, and mm -hmm. uh, we're trying to get the, you know, the town itself and everybody to come out here and find out what the Eagles is all about. Yeah. Hey, man, that's going to do it for us. I hope you had a great Halloween. Cindy, how can people find out more about Steel Horse Thunder? They go to steelhorsethunder.com and they can find everything they want. Everything. Everything is there. YouTube, Facebook, TikTok. We got it all going on right now. Make sure you like. Make sure you subscribe. Hit the notification bell. Do all that stuff. And most importantly, always remember, it's not what you ride. It's that you ride. <laughs>